All right, so this is Groly. This is the app I was talking about. I'm already signed in, so I have a dashboard button in the top right corner, but if you're not, you'll see a sign up or a login button, so just go ahead and sign up. Once you log in with a new account, you'll be prompted to connect your Instagram account. Mine's already connected, so I see this dashboard that just shows me some basic statistics on my number of followers compared to last week, last month, that kind of stuff. Um, and next thing you're gonna wanna do once you connect your Instagram account is go to your manage account page and then click this manage account button. Now, this is the section where you can download the Growly app to your Mac or Windows. I'm on a Mac and what I noticed was because this app is not on the Apple App Store, I have to go into my um, security settings for my Mac and then allow the app to be downloaded because it's not verified through Apple because it's not on the App Store. But all this tutorials can be um, found on their tutorial page and it'll kind of walk you through how to do everything start to finish. But this is also where you can set your like and interactions, uh, automatic direct messaging or the automatic unfollow. Um, for the purpose of this video, we're gonna focus on the unfollow. If you wanna check out my other videos on the like and interaction, I have one of those. But basically this app, you can go on and it will automatically like people's photos. It will watch their stories. It will like their stories. It can automatically direct message them. And so what this will do is drive a lot of traffic and presence to your page. Um, and if you're marketing a service, you can also use it for marketing purposes. Um, but for the unfollow section, it's pretty straightforward. Click the unfollow tab, uh, choose whether you want to unfollow all of your followers or uh, unfollow users who don't follow you back for the purpose of this video. I'm gonna select this, you choose an amount and whether you wanna run the program in the background or not. I prefer in the background because I like to do other stuff on my computer, so that way the bot is just kind of doing its thing. I don't have to watch it on the browser. If you want to watch what the bot is doing, you can leave that unchecked and it will pull up a Chrome browser and the bot will, you'll see the bot interacting without you obviously doing anything. So just go ahead and choose your settings and then go ahead and click download config, which will download the config file that you set up for your target settings. Now, once you do that and you've opened the Growly app, um, you can just go ahead and choose the file, choose downloads, configuration file, upload that file, and then start the bot. As you can see on this log over here, and also it did open up the browser for me. Um, let's pull up the log. So it's logging in the user and um, doing all that. So please keep in mind that this bot does take time to work. Um, it you, want, you don't want to get banned on Instagram, so the bot will be slow and have certain timeouts because it's kind of act like a user on Instagram. A user on Instagram is not going to do all these actions all at once. Um, and so you really want to make sure that you're using these bots safely. That way you don't get your account banned. But I've not had any issues with Growly since I've been using it because Growly is the only bot that I've found that operates on your own computer, your own IP address, and it's very hard for Instagram to actually pick that up as a bot. But if you're using another ser uh, service that is a bot that is acting on another server and another IP address that's not your typical IP address that you log in from, Instagram's gonna flag your account and it's gonna be able to detect that bot activity very easily. So. If you have any questions or if this video helped, I would really appreciate a, a like on this video and leave a comment below if you enjoyed the video. If you have any questions, I'll be happy to answer any questions I can. But um, if you have any questions, this Growly app also has a live chat feature and they've been pretty responsive for any questions that I've had. So go ahead, check it out, leave a comment to let me know what you think of the bot. And I hope this video helped.